Today we're going to be making mosaic tile rocks. First you start out by just picking your rock out. You can have choices that you or your assistant have gathered. You can take a little field trip, um, add a couple steps to grade this activity, which I'll talk about later. Um, but if your rocks are already displayed for you, as you see here, um, you can just pick out your rock. I decided to pick out this one because it has some flat edges. And then we have an assortment of tiles here, some with words. So you can pick out what's meaningful to you. I'm going to pick out the fun one because I think this activity is fun. So what you're going to do is you're going to glue on the tiles using a glue adhesive. So you just dab the glue onto the back of the tile. The adhesive we're using today is for indoor and outdoor use. And so I'm just going to glue this. You push onto the rock and then I'll repeat the steps by picking out my assorted tiles and the colors that I want to use and the shapes that I want to use, dabbing onto the back of the tile and pressing on the rock. I've decided I'm going to display mine outside. As I mentioned, I pick some outdoor glue adhesive, um, but there are a variety of glues you can choose based on if you wanted to use indoor, you can use like Gorilla Glue, um, that sort of thing. You want to definitely pick a glue that is heat resistant somewhat because even displaying in a window indoors, um, it's going to be exposed to sunlight and you don't want your tiles to fall off. The tiles should be put about no more than a half inch apart. So you can keep placing on additional tiles until the, the rock is all filled with the tiles and they're spaced no more than a half inch apart. Um, and that's because we're going to add some mortar later, which is grout. If you wanted to wear gloves for this activity, you could. If you didn't want to get any on your hands, any glue. But make sure you have a sink handy because you want to wash your hands up after. There is going to be some glue getting on your fingers. Don't worry about any getting any excess glue anywhere on the rock because you're going to cover it up with the grout later. Get another blue one. And I can move this. The glue takes about 10 or 15 minutes to dry, so you can kind of slide around these tiles if you need to adjust them. And I think I'm going to move this one here, and then I'll be able to put a yellow in there. See? That's easy. I'm going to put one more here. So like I said, you just repeat these steps of gluing the tiles. If you have someone with fine motor skill issues, you might want to pick a larger rock. They don't have to put as many tiles on this, but a larger surface area would accommodate 
um, their gross motor skills. You can also choose large, these large pieces as opposed to something that's little and round. This would help when grading down the activity. Um, instead of having these type of tiles here, if uh, you can purchase larger ones, of large round ones, different shapes, but larger in size. Also, if you wanted to use a different knife or a spoon for the glue, um, they make large bottles. You could actually put the glue in a large bottle if, um, if their grasp is pretty good and their strength is good. You could grade up the activity by doing that if you wanted to incorporate the strength into your activity. And I think I'm good. Okay. So you're going to scoop your grout and just spread it. It doesn't matter if you get it on the tiles. You're going to push it gently in between. Your tiles. You're going to wipe them off later. So this part doesn't matter. If you get it on the paper, if you get it on the tiles, it doesn't matter. You can also color your grout. If you wanted to squeeze a couple of tablespoons of acrylic paint into any color that you wanted to, this is acrylic paint. You can squeeze a couple tablespoons into the cup and then you would stir that and mix it up and that would provide you with a different background color of your liking. After you finish pressing it into all the spaces, the grout, then you're going to wipe off the tiles using either a paper towel or a sponge. After you've let your grout dry according to the directions on the grout bag, which is about 30 minutes or even overnight, um, you're going to spray the top and sides of the rocks with the grout sealer. This also can be, you can use a clear glass polyurethane, which is what I'm using because I want to display my rocks outside. So you go ahead and make sure you have covering, that you've used your newspaper covering, and go ahead and spray the top and the sides. This is another rock. Uh, which is a little bit of a different one. We use paint instead of grout, but I want to display this outside. So I'm going to spray that one too. Now this needs to dry for about 30 minutes, but if you're going to display something outside or in a really temperature, like a sunny window where it's going to get warm, I would suggest letting this sit for 24 hours before displaying outside or in a window. Here's another variation where we just use tiles to glue. So if you're going to grade down this activity, Again, you can use larger tiles and you can use just the glue um, and still display this outside if you're using outdoor glue um, and you don't even need to paint. So you can, of course, choose what you want to have for your background. Choose the colors and the type of material and enjoy your rocks outside or give them as gifts or enjoy it in a sunny window in your home. I hope you enjoyed watching and learning as much as I have making mosaic tile rocks. If you love the outdoors, exploring, walking in nature, you'll love to be able to go on a mini field trip and pick out your own rocks to use for this activity. It's for children and the aging elderly of any age can do this. You can grade it up or grade it down based on the activity level. I love gardening. This is meaningful to me because I love being outdoors and you can enjoy the fruits of your labor as you see in your pictures here. You can plant the rocks, so to speak, in your vegetable garden, your flower garden, and enjoy them every day, any time of year.